Hey everybody, I um, want to show you another kind of quirky but pretty fun um, handgun in the collection. This is a Beretta Model 950B. This is otherwise known as the Beretta Minx, as you can see right there. Beretta loves to name their guns after cats, so this is no exception. Um, what makes this one kind of unique is it is a 22 short pistol. Not 22 long or 22 long rifle, it shoots 22 shorts. Um, and I don't think this one is still in production, although uh, Beretta still produces other models like the Bobcat um, that are very similar to this, just in 22 long rifle. So um, this particular pistol, uh, as you can see, that the one that I have is in just outstanding condition. Um, beautiful bluing. Uh, it is, as you can see, it is made in Italy. Uh, some of the Berettas are made in, in the United States and Maryland. Um, this guy, though, is made overseas, and it's got, I think this is kind of cool if you can see it right there, it's got the armory marks um, stamped into the metal. But um, this is super small. I mean, there it is against my palm. Very, very small pistol. Um, it is, as you can see, it is semi-automatic. The magazine release is right down there. And we're just going to safety check this. And it is, magazine is empty. And to check the chamber, um, kind of neat thing here is you just move that lever and boom, there it goes. So you can see it's totally unloaded. Um, so this is just like the Bobcat in the sense that it's got the tip up barrel. Um, and you can see right down it as well. Uh, it's got that nice tip-up barrel, which is really cool. The, the nice feature about that is you actually never have to rack the slide. You can just load your magazine, uh, activate the barrel release, and drop around right in there. And once you close it, you're ready to just pull the hammer back and um, take your first shot. It's already, uh, it's already chambered. So, um, and of course, once you take your first shot, it, it is a semi-automatic, so it'll eject the shell, and, and uh, it will be, um, you know, ready to take the, uh, it'll be cocked to take the next, um, the next one, the next one right away. So, um, beautiful pistol, as you might imagine, um, a 22 short is, uh, <laughs> there's not much recoil to those little rounds, there, it's more, I mean, I got this for fun more than anything else, and I just think it's kind of cool that the rounds are so small, um, you know, I certainly wouldn't want to be hit by one, um, but I really don't know what the practical applications of this particular pistol are. I mean, if you want a small mouse gun for self-defense, you can get, I think, um, better ones, uh, you know, in 380, or if you really needed to, you could even get a 22 long rifle, which would um, certainly give you more power than this. Um, one note on the ammunition, uh, it does not... Um, at first, I was feeding it the uh, CCI, the CB, the conical ball. Um, those are really, really light rounds. Uh, I'm not sure there's much powder in them at all. Um, and it wasn't cycling the action. But certainly if you get any sort of potent, um, you know, to the extent that 22 shorts potent, but one of the more potent 22 shorts, uh, you can, um, you'll have no trouble cycling the action. So um, I've got some... Uh, I think Remington, um, it really liked the Remington uh, Golden Bullets in um, the 22 short. And uh, I just got some um, Winchester 22 shorts. I haven't had a chance to try them, but they, I'm sure they're going uh, sure to be fine. And look at that crest on there. It's just beautiful. I think Breda just makes some very, very attractive um, firearms. They just have an, an eye for design. So um, that's really about it. I mean, this would be a backup gun. Um, it could be, you know, sort of a deep concealment gun if you needed it to be that. Uh, you know, as I said, I, I really think you'd be better off with, you know, either one of those really small nines, um, like the uh, Smith & Wesson Shield or, um, you know, a 380 like the Ruger LCP. But anyways, um, they're kind of cool, and I think they are truly uh, an attractive pistol. So um, that's that. It's a fun one to add to the collection. Um, and I hope you enjoyed watching. Thanks a lot.